Hey Austin, what's new? Well, first off, it's summer, and that is not cool. <laughs> uh, but really though, it was like 118 the other day. For those of you that don't know, I live in Tucson, Arizona. It's too hot, too hot, Arizona. Ah, don't remember that. I figured I should make a video and let you guys know kind of what's been happening the past month, really. Um, actually, this chair is super high, and so I get to swing my feet and feel like a little kid. Well, I, I always feel like a little kid. I'm like 5'7". A trailer just released of a movie that I was in called No Sunday West of Newton. When that comes out, you guys should definitely check it out. I'm going to put the trailer uh, in the screen somewhere. Feel free to click that and head on over there but uh, after, or check it out and then come back to this video. Just don't stop watching this. I look at my analytics, okay? This one isn't really like new news. It's just news. Um, it may be new to you if you haven't been following me on social media. I have shirts available um, like this. Like this bad boy right here. It says Cluster Cuss. Uh, for those of you that don't know, a fox is my favorite animal. And that is off the movie The Fantastic Mr. Fox. They replace all the curse words with cuss or cussing. Yeah. I'm sure I'll put a link somewhere where you can click it. Don't worry. Because I only work two days in the summer, I've been uh, putting my time to use. And I've been auditioning to a lot more movies and TV shows and stuff like that. So I've been sending in a lot of video auditions, which kind of makes me step away from making videos because I'm making videos in a different way, I guess, if that makes sense. I live with two of my best friends called Tyler, called, I call them Tyler and Sam. Their name is Tyler and Sam. I've said this like 20 times trying to just get it out. You get the idea. We've started a podcast called Time Wasters. Um, not that creative, but I like it. If you would like to check it out, you can look us up on iTunes, or we have a Patreon page, actually. Um, if you don't know what Patreon is, it's a free tipping and reward site where you can donate some of your hard-earned money to us, and we'll keep making podcasts. The podcast is free. Don't worry about it. Uh, but that's patreon.com slash timewasters. And we kind of just talk about anything, really. We may start on one subject, but then it just keeps going different ways, and... One of our episodes was 100% just only about poop. I don't, I don't know how that happened, but I like it. And I hope you like it. Another year is going by where I'm not going to VidCon. So that kind of sucks. Um, really wish I could be there for all my friends that are gonna be there. Just have a blast. Just take a lot of pictures and send them to me. I don't know, I feel kind of weird going to VidCon now. Just because all the big YouTubers, I have no idea who they are. People are making like huge deals about this person and this person. I'm like, I, I guess I've just been out of the game? I don't know. I'm used to people that have been on since like 2006, 2007, 2008. And there's all these Vine people? I don't know. It's like they're a whole different race. Vine people that have switched over to YouTube. And they're like the big stars. and. That's cool, but I don't know who they are, and I don't really want to know. I don't care to get to know them. But regardless, if you are going to VidCon, I'm sure you're going to have a great time. Um, my first time going was just, it was a blast, and I'll never forget. I made some of my friends there, some of my other YouTuber friends. Um, yeah. VidCon is a good thing. Regardless who is big in YouTube, I think it is just a really great thing. I think they should maybe do like separate VidCons because there's like VidCon in LA. They should also have like Arizona VidCon. Is that something you would be interested in? I wouldn't mind doing that. Imagine me speaking on stage. It'd be a train wreck. And last but not least, I have had to get a new car. Um, Bad Wolf finally quit on me. I had a little car and it the transmission was going out. I'm gonna start saying things that are wrong with it that I, I'm not too sure. But it was, it was just not worth, if you can hear it, a plane is interrupting me right now. I'll wait. But because my old car took a poop, the, uh, some of the chameleon circuits in the flux capacitor gave out, and I wasn't too sure if I should buy a new car or if I should just sell that one. Luckily, I got an offer to sell it more than what I thought, so 
that was the best deal I could possibly do, and I got a new car named Rory. All my cars are named Companions. You'll get used to it. That may sound weird that I, I named a car after a guy, but it, it just looks more like a guy, you know? My motorcycle was Rose Tyler, my Ford Escape was Martha Jones, my bicycle was Donna Noble, and my new car was Bad Wolf, and so I decided to name it Rory because I don't really like Amelia. And hopefully I have this car for a while. I'm, I'm really tired of getting new cars all the time. If you don't know, the past two years of my life have just been completely surrounded by car accidents. It's been awesome. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I thought I would update you on my life since for some reason you are interested in it. Interested in it, whatever. Thank you. And, uh, okay, bye.